Okay, hi students. Today we are going to discuss depreciation of fixed asset. So the first method will be straight line method. In this method, we have two type of formula. So the first formula, we need to use our cost of fixed asset to divide by the useful life, which is how many year. Then another method, another formula will be we use the cost to times the depreciation rate. Okay, so we are going to see some few of examples. So the first example we will fill, we will use the first formula, which is the cost divided by the useful life. So let's say I give you guys a cost of furniture, which is twenty thousand. Then for this use, this furniture is estimated to use for around five years. So how we do for the how we calculate the furniture depreciation? So the first thing that we already know is the cost twenty thousand, and we already know the useful life is five years. Then we just use twenty thousand to divide by five years. So we got our depreciation amount, which is four thousand. So this is for the first formula, and we go to another example. Which is example two. So this example two, we will use the formula two. So I also give you a cost of furniture, which is twenty five thousand. But we have a scrap value, which cost five thousand, and we estimate the useful life is about. Five years also. So how we calculate this? So for this one, the first thing we need to use the cost to minus the scrap value. Then we only can divide by the year. So for depreciation, we will need to use the cost twenty five thousand to minus the scrap value five thousand. Then we divide by the years. So from here we got twenty thousand. Divided by five years, the final answer will be four thousand. So this is the first met method, and the, this also similar to the first formula. And now we go to the second formula. Example three. So for example three, we are going to use the formula two. This question, I will give you a cost of furniture also. And it's cost for thirty thousand. So, but for the question, the business already give you about the depreciation rate, which is ten percent. So now you already have the cost and you have the depreciation rate. So how we calculate for the depreciation? So we gonna to use the formula two. So we will use thirty thousand. Two times the rate, which is ten percent, then we will got the answer, which is three thousand. 